Israel's new military breakthrough has stunned analysts worldwide. Imagine a technology so advanced it changes how wars are fought before a single shot is fired. From AI-driven precision to unseen defense capabilities, this secret development is rewriting the future of global power. And today, you're about to discover exactly why the world is speechless. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the channel today. We're diving into one of the most jaw-dropping developments the defense world has seen in years. Israel, a nation already known for its high-tech military arsenal, has just revealed a breakthrough that pushed global analysts, strategists, and rival nations into complete shock. While many countries boast about futuristic weapons, few actually deliver something that changes the rules. But this time, Israel may have crossed that threshold. This innovation isn't just another upgrade or routine enhancement, it's a step into a new era of warfare where speed, AI intelligence, and unmatched accuracy blend into a single unbelievable system. As we break this down, we'll explore what this breakthrough is, how it works, and why global superpowers are now scrambling to respond. Whether you're fascinated by defense technology, geopolitics, or the science behind next-gen warfare, this is one episode you don't wanna miss. So sit tight, because what you're about to hear might reshape how you think about modern power on the battlefield. Let's, let's get started. Israel's new breakthrough didn't appear overnight. It's the result of years of classified research, underground testing, and partnerships between military engineers and private defense tech giants. But what makes this invention extraordinary is that it solves a problem every nation has struggled with how to respond instantly to multiple threats from air, land, and sea without human delay. Traditional systems rely on operators, radar coordination, command centers, and decision time. Israel's new system bypasses all of that. It uses advanced AI that identifies, tracks, predicts, and neutralizes threats in real time, far faster than human reaction speed. This shift from human assisted to AI Dominant warfare is what shocked the world. It signals the beginning of a battlefield where machines think, decide, and act before the enemy even realizes what happened. Several nations, including major powers, are calling this a destabilizing leap, while others see it as the inevitable next step in global security. Israel's ability to integrate this tech into its already formidable defense network hints at the emergence of a new military standard, one that rivals must quickly adapt to or risk being left behind entirely. So what exactly is this technology? At the core is a hybrid system combining AI, laser precision, multi-layer sensors, and next-gen communication links. Think of it as the brain of an entire battlefield. It doesn't just detect threats, it understands their behavior. It predicts flight paths, identifies weapon types, calculates impact probabilities, and even determines the best counter response all in microseconds. What's even more shocking is its self-learning capability. Every new threat from drones to hypersonic projectiles becomes part of its expanding database. That means the more it operates, the smarter it becomes. This technology can manage swarms of drones, intercept incoming missiles, protect armored vehicles, and even coordinate air support all simultaneously. The breakthrough isn't just its speed, but its accuracy and autonomy. It significantly reduces mistakes, collateral damage, and reaction time. In Israel's tests, it reportedly achieved near perfect interception rates outperforming conventional systems by a staggering margin. This is what forced global analysts to take notice. When a country gains the ability to counter almost any threat faster than it can be launched, that's no longer just an upgrade, it's a revolution. When footage of the initial testing surfaced, military observers were stunned, not because of explosions or dramatic visuals, but because of the absence of them. The system operated so smoothly and quietly that some experts called it surgical warfare. Incoming drones vanished mid-air without visible trails. 
Missiles were halted before reaching critical altitude. Enemy surveillance attempts were blocked instantly, leaving no trace of their approach. This level of precision is made possible by the network of sensors, high resolution radars, infrared tracking, long range optics, and encrypted communication grids that work together like a single organism. Unlike older systems that rely on heavy hardware, Israel's new breakthrough uses lightweight, energy efficient components that allow faster deployment and wider coverage. In other words, it can be positioned anywhere borders, sea platforms, and even mobile vehicles. This flexibility is what truly separates it from earlier technologies. Experts from Europe, the US, and Asia called this demonstration a wake up call. If a small nation can achieve this level of advancement, major powers must rethink their strategies, budgets, and priorities. Israel didn't just introduce a system, it introduced a shift in global military expectations. One of the biggest factors behind the shock is how this breakthrough affects air dominance. Air superiority has always been the defining advantage in war. But Israel's new system challenges that idea completely. It doesn't matter whether the threat is a long-range ballistic missile, a stealth drone, or a fighter jet. The system analyzes them all with equal efficiency. Traditional air defenses are layered to handle different threats, but Israel's new tech merges those layers into a unified defense brain. Aircraft attempting to penetrate its coverage zone face immediate detection, even stealth models. Small drones attempting low altitude approaches are intercepted instantly, and high speed weapons, once considered nearly impossible to stop, are now within its capabilities. This forced major countries to rethink their approach to air combat. If one nation can deny access to its skies with this level of reliability, future battles may shift from offensive strategies to tech-based defensive wars. Israel essentially redefined the rules of airspace protection, and this breakthrough could influence the next generation of aircraft, missiles, and unmanned systems worldwide. Beyond air defense, the system's impact on ground warfare is equally transformative. Israel has integrated this breakthrough into armored vehicles, making them smarter, safer, and deadlier. These vehicles can detect hidden threats such as anti-tank missiles or roadside explosives long before they come close. They can reroute themselves, deploy countermeasures, and share battlefield intelligence with nearby units, all autonomously. This enhances survivability for soldiers and increases effectiveness in complex environments like urban combat zones, where split-second decisions save lives. The system's AI doesn't only protect, it helps command. It creates a real-time 3D map of the battlefield, highlighting enemy positions, predicting movements, and recommending optimal attack or retreat strategies. It communicates with drones for aerial surveillance, ground robots for support, and artillery for precision strikes. No nation has ever combined such layers of technology into a single operational network at this scale. That's why global analysts are calling this not just a breakthrough, but a blueprint for future ground warfare. Armies without AI integrated systems may find themselves outdated faster than expected. The naval implications are equally game changing. Israel's coastline, though small, is strategically vital and its new breakthrough drastically enhances maritime defense. Naval vessels equipped with the system can detect underwater drones, approaching missiles, pirate boats, or hostile submarines with unprecedented speed. The AI processes wave patterns, acoustic signatures, and radar reflections to identify threats earlier than human operators ever could. It can also command defensive drones that patrol the sea surface, acting like intelligent shields for the fleet. This makes naval blockades, coastal attacks, and hostile infiltration far more difficult for enemies to execute what shocked global analysts is how seamlessly Israel adapted this breakthrough into existing naval platforms. Instead of building entirely new ships, 
Israel upgraded its current fleet with this next-gen capability, proving that the future of warfare doesn't always require huge budgets, just better technology for countries with long coastlines or contested waters. This represents a major strategic shift. The ability to protect maritime assets with AI, driven speed and precision changes naval warfare just as dramatically as it changes air and land combat. The geopolitical impact has been massive. Within days of the public reveal, several nations began requesting classified briefings while others quietly started accelerating their own defense research. Some global powers see Israel's breakthrough as a stabilizing force, an innovation that could neutralize aggressive missile programs in unstable regions. Others see it as disruptive, claiming it could trigger an arms race centered not on weapons, but on AI and autonomous warfare. Military alliances are taking note, Countries already cooperating with Israel through defense deals may gain access to early export versions, strengthening regional partnerships. On the other hand, nations opposed to Israel now face a strategic disadvantage that may take years to overcome. Even superpowers are acknowledging the shift. Analysts say that if this technology becomes widely adopted, it could reshape global military balance more significantly than drones or cyber warfare once did. Israel, a relatively small nation, may have just forced world powers to rethink their assumptions about who leads the future of military innovation. But with every breakthrough comes serious questions. Experts warn that autonomous systems must be monitored carefully to prevent unintended escalation. When machines react faster than humans, the margin for miscalculation becomes smaller. Israel has emphasized that strict human oversight remains part of the system, but critics argue that global adoption of such technologies could lead to misinterpretations between rival nations. Another concern is cyber threat vulnerability, while Israel's new system uses advanced encryption, the idea of hacking or disrupting an AI-driven defense network is a topic being debated worldwide. Still, supporters argue that the benefits far outweigh the risks. The system not only protects civilians by reducing collateral damage, but also ensures faster, more accurate decisions during crises. And because it requires fewer human operators, it reduces manpower costs and potential human casualties. This debate, autonomy via human control, will define the future of warfare. Israel's breakthrough simply accelerated the conversation. At its core, Israel's new military breakthrough represents the merging of technology, strategy, and national survival. For decades, Israel relied on innovation to stay ahead of threats. But this time, it's not just staying ahead, it's redefining the entire game. This system is more than hardware, it's a philosophy of future warfare, a battlefield where speed beats strength, intelligence beats numbers, and precision beats power. It sends a message across the world the future will belong to nations that master AI, integration, and real-time decision systems. Whether you admire Israel or simply study global defense trends, one thing is clear, the world will not forget this breakthrough anytime soon. Countries will race to catch up, alliances will evolve, and the global military landscape will shift in ways we are only beginning to understand. What Israel unveiled isn't just a technology, it's the future arriving ahead of schedule. If you found this breakdown fascinating, make sure to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you never miss another deep dive into cutting edge military technology. And let me know in the comments, do you think this breakthrough will reshape global power? Let's discuss.